okay, so here we have the question of which add progress count to believe. One of them is done, one of them is not. Um, but uh, hopefully we are here live and uh, happy Sunday. Um, I took a poll last week to see if folks wanted to continue with the Cube Escape collection. Um, and the answer was no, move on. So we are moving on to the next game in my library, which happens to be Cube Escape Paradox. Um, the Cube Escape collection contains the first nine games. This one's the 10th. So um, I'm assuming this one is longer, probably because it's its own game. Apparently it comes with like a free movie. Um, the first part of this game is free. Um, I did, after playing Cube Escape Collection, I did go ahead and purchase the DLC for Cube Escape Paradox um, because it was like three bucks. And they said it's, you, it, you basically, it's the second part of the game and you can get another ending. Um, and being that I liked Cube Escape Collection, I figured I would go ahead and sign up for that. Um, yeah, so I guess uh, this is the second to last game in the Seas, um, the final game in Seas is Cultist Simulator, so I'll be trying that out next weekend, and then I guess we'll have to give a review of the Seas. Um, yeah, I think uh, I, I had to fight with Streamlabs today to get this to work. I could only get it to work on uh, screen capture rather than game capture, so hopefully it doesn't lag. Um, there we go. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's get started with it. Okay, so this is the DLC that I got. Ooh. Ah, okay. So the the clicking that photo linked me to Rusty Lake Paradise, which I guess is their next game. Um, I'm just gonna close that. So we're gonna try out chapter one, I guess. I've been here before. Oh, hey, it's the lady. Is she here? Dude, are these games interconnected? These games might be interconnected. Use the arrows to move around. Okay. Click the down arrow to move back. All right, so they're assuming that we have no, uh, no experience. This is busted. Oh, hey, this is like the same. Oh, no, it's not. It's a different, different kind of thing. Um, quality of life improvement. You can go forward or backward. All right, all that's locked. We'll come back to that later. Here's a globe. Doesn't do anything at present. A plant. Okay. Light fixtures. We know to look in the light fixtures. All right. Doesn't look like you can look up in this one, um, like you could in previous. Hey, it's the bird. I wonder if this is a direct sequel to um, Seasons that we played. Is that me? I'm a bit cold. We've got a key. The slide puzzle?
Get that out later. Oh, I guess this doesn't open. Usually it would say like locked. Be behind there. I'll leave it open just in case. All right, doesn't it stay open? Um. Yeah. <laughs> the shadowy figure. Photo piece. You know, the classic photo piece that won't pull down. Armoire there. Use items from your inventory. Oh, we actually have to put it in place. That's different. The um, previous game, you could just... Uh, it, it automatically hooked into place. Both of those are locked. The telephone... Rusty Lake, Mental Health and Fishing. We will help you balance the substance of your past lives. After completion of our mental health program, you will feel reborn. Not the blue vial, D. I? Okay, that doesn't seem to do anything at present. These are all locked. Okay. This should be the final wall. A pencil. Another photo piece. Some scissors. A cassette player. Yeah, this is definitely like callbacks to seasons. Um, with the clock and the cassette player and the parrot. Escape. Is that easy? <laughs> nope. Uh, light switch? Oh, jacket. I wasn't expecting that to be a... I woke up in this room. I feel different. Less real. Where is she? a password entering yeah and I cannot look up oh this turned on the light which call back another photo piece um, so let us assemble the photo oh I think there may be more than four pieces There are more than four pieces. They're like, okay, we're you're advanced now at this point. Not the blue bottle. That's the blue bottle right there. Um, let's see. I guess we could try using the key on stuff. Uh, no, this wasn't the one with the locked drawer. This was. Wooden cube. Oh, I... Thought it would go here. Because it, it looks like this, but I guess not. Uh, maybe here? I just got an extra achievement. Chapter 1, Wooden Cube. Well, that was an extra? I wasted my key on an extra? Hmm. 
We can change the clock hands. And it stays changed. So that's going to be important later. like try to interact with stuff. It just seems weird that that's a thing you can zoom on, in on if it doesn't do anything. Um, so this obviously needs to be repaired. I'm sure it's not this simple. Sure, it's not that simple. Interestingly, it also saves. Um, those things are locked. Okay, this seems like a simple slide puzzle, simple-ish. Uh, that's the that's the problem right there. Um, hmm. Will it reset if I... No, it's not nice enough to reset. Okay. No. Okay, that's up there. Okay, 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 I think we've got this. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Oh, that was all for a photo piece? Okay. Alrighty then. Um, it seems very strange that that cannot open, but... Oops. Photo piece goes right here. Looks like there's maybe one or two more photo pieces. I imagine it has to be some kind of weight. Don't seem to be able to dial the phone.
I'm, I'm missing whatever it is that is needed for that to work. I'm hoping that's not the next puzzle that I have to do, because I have no idea how to solve that. Can't open his cage. Can't put a jacket over his cage. Would you like a cigar, sir? Mm. Okay. Cut it up, drawn it. Yeah, I I don't know. Oh God. I don't know how to use a rotary phone. Make me use a rotary phone? Okay, 911 doesn't get me anywhere. they've had um no this doesn't work because it's there's no power i haven't found anything yet that could serve as a power connector hey i can trim the tree Interesting. Okay. All right, didn't think so. But where would I put this twig? Hey, you want a twig, buddy? A twig would be useful in the globe. It kind of seems like something's missing right here, like a, like a pin.
it's at at this time. I'm wondering if the painting could be a clue to the safe. It does have five digits. Or five symbols. A one, a V, and then J O O. Even if it is, I'm I'm not sure what that would mean. Super Bass, it is indeed cube game. Um, this is a uh, Cube Escape Paradox. It was the next thing in my Steam library. It's the tenth game. Um, cube Escape Collection had the first nine games, and then this is the tenth game. They sold separately. Although the first part of it is actually free. I did um, pay for the DLC since I liked Cube Escape Collection so much, so I figured I... But it's it's free to try. Um, I'm a little bit stuck right now, though. Um, this game, I think, is, is going to be a little bit longer, but that also has the little bit of a disadvantage of... Uh, that I paid money for it? Yeah. Um, I think this has a little bit of a disadvantage of... I haven't, maybe because I haven't played the other games, it does seem to be like some interconnected plot. So it might be that I'm missing some things. Um, but I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm a little bit stuck at the moment. I've done a couple of things. I not only paid money for it, I paid money for more of it. Yeah. Yeah, because I really liked this cube, the Cube Escape collection. So these are all locked. I've got some photo... I have maybe one or two pieces left of the photo, and this seems to be maybe the guy and woman from the Seasons game, the first one I played. Um, we have this, but it can't pull down. This, which to me looks like an I, a V, and J-O-O, -O, but I don't know what that is. Um, we have a, a letter that says, stay away from the blue vial. Um, we can dial the phone, but I don't know what to dial. These are also locked. I use the scissors to trip off to trim off this little twig, but I'm not sure what to do with it. Um, we can change the hands of the clock. Not sure what to do with that. Uh, there's a cassette player, but there's nothing in it. Um, I have emptied these drawers. 
including uh, this one, which I used my key on, and the key gave me this little cube thing, which gave me an achievement. So I'm like, wait, did I just waste my key on an extra? I didn't know that. Um, there's this cabinet, which very strangely does not open, nor does it say it's locked. So I'm not sure if, if it's just decoration or something. Um, this does not appear to do anything. Um, we've got Birdo is back. We've got the mirror. I can look at myself. I'm a bit cold. Um, I already solved these two things. This was a slide puzzle. This had a key in it. Um, the slide puzzle gave me... What did the slide puzzle give me? Oh, it gave me another um, photo piece. Which I was like, wow, I had to work hard for that photo piece. And that's where we're at. Some things I haven't used yet are the cigar, the pencil, and the jacket, and the twig. Oh, there's also a typewriter. I don't know if I showed that to you. I woke up in this room. I feel felt different, less real. Where is she? And I've tried typing a couple of things, but I'm I don't think it's gonna do anything unless I know what to type. You were trying to do the ultimate puzzle and raid earlier today? Oh, what did that do? Extremely fortunate to own a specific character at the absolute max awakening. Tried to see if he can solo the game's uber boss. The answer is yes. Technically, bug, it's RNG right now. I can't put the jacket back, so I definitely need to do something with it. Um, I tried, uh, oh hey! She wasn't there before. Hi lady. How's it going? I'm, I'm hopefully not gonna murder you this time. Um, bu, 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 bu. oh, you can't look up this time. Oh, but it's RNG right now. Yeah. Can't unplug the power. Can't cut the power either. I plug this in. I'm assuming it, pu it powers this safe or like something over here. Um, originally this was all on these symbols, but I don't know what symbols I need to do. Um, the symbols are the same ones that were used in the slide puzzle, which I can no longer look at. Um... The globe doesn't do anything so far. And the TV doesn't have power. So a couple of different issues. I did get a photo piece from the lamp already from turning the light on. Turn the light back off. I cannot turn the light back off. They're like, it's on forever now, buddy. Um... Might be to the point that we click on random stuff with random stuff until something happens, which I feel like I wasn't at this point as early in <laughs> the other games. They were a little bit simpler to figure out. Um, I'm gonna do just a quick ad break and get an apple because I, I need some fuel, man. That's crazy that you can solo a boss when you're supposed to be in, like, raid group.
Oh, I can see me holding the jacket. He took the jacket from me. Well, that's what we get for clicking on random stuff. Oh! I don't have it anymore. Wait. I don't have it anymore. It's not lighted. I'm aware it's not lighted, but... Okay, well, I think I figured out how to progress. Oh, hey. The woman. Let's see what happens if I type the woman. Raw to fill. Run. They're like, we have technology that is not available to us before. Thinking maybe she's uh, in an unexpected place. Like maybe I have to scribble around the whole thing. It's interesting that you can layer it. I don't know that I'm doing this right. Maybe I'm supposed to draw her. On the chase. And then maybe she'll be there. Nope. So I think I need to find some kind of lighter. Oh, this is new. A place to empty the mind, reflect on the past and future.
Okay, surely the answer to that is Rusty Lake. But maybe not. It looks like I'm supposed to color myself in. So I'm gonna try that. Okay. I have to get out of here. I know I did it before, but the door is closed. Why do I keep thinking of her? I never met this woman. It was just another murder case. Oh, that's interesting. So our guy is a cop, maybe? What do I know about her? How did she die? Flash across the throat. Yep. Case 23 might be the key to escape my mind. Oh, I guess that's it. Well, that got me another key. Opens this one. All right. Case 23. Would you look at that? Oh, there's a arrow up there. Duh. Case 23, the death of Laura Vanderbloom. Evidence A, body, body woman. Evidence B, newspaper article. Evidence C, prescription. Evidence D, contest, Rusty Lake. Evidence E, piece of dress. And also, A, B, C, D. Okay. So more stuff I need to find. And then what is this? This is the thing that I powered up. Slide projector? Need to find slides? Okay. Oh, hey, there's more stuff up here. A cassette tape, that looks like a slide. And a newspaper article, hey! We're doing stuff, do, 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 do. We are doing stuff. There's a newspaper article. Oh, interesting. It has a, it has a symbol on it now. It didn't before. Um, slide projector. Well, I'm assuming I have to go look at the slide. Or maybe not. We projected- oh, I need to pull this down. 
can't pull it down still. Okay. Alright, so that might come later. Um, I do have a cassette tape that I can listen to. Mr. Vandermeer, please tell me about your dream. Zack tape. I was watching TV. It was me on the screen. But I looked different. Um, I saw Channel 6, but I, uh... Oh, Channel 669. That doesn't do much because I... The TV doesn't have power at the moment. But we'll... We'll store that away for later. Um, looks like we got some books. A. Vanderbloom. Robert Hill false accusations. The art of fortune telling. Oh. I can move this one. Oh, well, maybe they need to go in a specific order. Hmm. Oh, doesn't appear to be by height. Um, it kept the order, so that probably means something. I-V-J-O-O. -O. Could... Could that be something? I, V, J, but there are six of these, there are only five letters, so I don't think that could be it. Hmm. It's empty now. Ah! That for this. Sorry, trying to study this. It has one, two, three, four, five, six listed twice. Did I pull it down too far? It, it, because this isn't like in line with. 
that looks like a clock, but there's nothing, there's no time. It has the one, two, three, four, five, six over the birdcage and over the cabinet that I can't open. It's got some circles here and here. And then it has a little thing with a little X with the birdcage. I don't know what any of this means. I don't know what this means. Okay, that's matched up better. Okay, I'm gonna go look at the areas that have the circles, I guess. Said to have it closed. This is where it had the circle, was here. And then up here. But that doesn't seem to do anything. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four. Four is circled. If I line everything up, four is circled. It's not that. Um, I think the photo is of the woman's body, so I'm gonna put that in the evidence thingy, in the case. Also an IV right here. Does it not have something on the wall next to the birdcage? And there definitely isn't anything there when I go to look at it. There's nothing here. That's weird. Yeah, but the wall with the scissors. <laughs> um, and this says four, which... Yeah, I don't I don't know how that helps us. Is the is this a symbol of any kind? Do any of the symbols resemble that? Nope. Not this time.
done anything with this yet. Wig in your nose. Put a twig on your antlers. Cut off your antlers. Or... Oh. Well, listen, we just crossed the one hour mark, so let me give my thoughts about this one. Um, so far, I preferred the Cube Escape collection um, because, I think literally because the games were smaller. Um, at this point in the seasons, I think I had already done two of the rooms, and having those little checkpoints kind of made me feel accomplished. Um, here, I do think I've progressed, like, to the second phase of this room. Um, you know, I've, I've, I found the key, which I think was big. Um, but yeah, I think it being longer is making me feel a little bit less accomplished. So it might be one of those things where maybe you try Cube Escape Collection first and maybe play through the whole thing, get a sense of the entire lore and things like that, because there is lore. This has a movie to go with it, by the way. And then maybe play this game? I'm not mad that I bought the DLC for it, because I do think I'm going to solve this eventually. I just feel like I'm solving it very slowly. And I don't yet want to give up, because I feel like I'm making decent progress. Five. Hey, it stayed. Get it. There's there's nothing to look at right here. Maybe this comes into play later on. But I do think it's interesting that it actually saved the spot this time. So maybe that is what I'm supposed to do next? Yeah. 
Yeah, it's definitely a step up in difficulty. What do? What do? Yeah, and it's like there should be something up here, too. Oh, it's so weird. I do think this is last. I think this is last. I think that's why they showed it to me right away. I think it's like the safe in VLR. Oh. And I wasn't able to look at any of these books. I could only reorder them. There isn't anything else to align with. That clock is interesting. And I'm assuming this does say IVJOO. It might be VVJOO. Maybe I could ignite the twig on the ashes? No. Rearranging them at random isn't really going to do much because there's too many permutations. Um... The 
everything in the pot. I mean, that's 669, but I don't think it's going to do anything until it has power. I don't know. I'm kind of thinking that this is enough with that. I, I, I don't know how to progress again. Maybe I should just fire up the last game in the seas. watch movie oh that comes up on uh it comes up on steam how long is this contents only available in online streaming format about this video, when the infamous detective Dale Vandermeer wakes up in an ominous room without any recollection of his past, he soon finds himself part of a bizarre game orchestrated by Old Foe as he must solve increasingly challenging puzzles to escape the room and recover his memories. Paradox, a Rusty Lake film, will be released together with the accompanying game Cube Escape Paradox. In this unique crossover, you follow Detective Dale Vandermeer who needs to escape the room in parallel universes. Both game and the short film will be connected in various ways, find secret symbols, unlock multiple endings, and above all, experience the same room in different ways. So maybe I need to watch this movie to progress? Maybe? Maybe try it again another, try it again another day game. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It sounds like a lot of work. Yeah. Um, am I able to save my progress? I'm assuming my progress gets saved because otherwise it reset would start it over. Oh, there's also a walkthrough if you want it, if it's too hard. You can ask for a hint on Discord or watch a video. They're like, yeah, we know this is difficult. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna we're gonna swap over and uh play this this other game. Um, but I like I said, I still don't regret my purchase. I think I will get to this eventually, just I don't wanna be watching a movie on stream to play a like <laughs> I don't think that's interesting. So 
um, interesting for you, that is. Um, so we're gonna, um, I'm gonna run an ad break and swap over. So uh, I shall BRB.